My name is Monika Zagrobelna and this is how to create a metallic text effect using layer styles in Photoshop originally written by Enrica Elisabe for Envato Tats Plus. Before we start, please download the assets specified in the description. To install the patterns and contours, simply double click them. Create a new document with these dimensions. Duplicate the background and rename the new layer as background pattern. Now we are going to add a texture to the background layer. Double click on background pattern layer to open the layer style window. Go to pattern overlay and then click on the pattern box to select the new added dark pattern. Press OK. To make the background look even better, we are going to add an inner shadow. You have to double click the background layer and once the layer style window appears, set the following values. Type the word Metal Kid using the Strasua font. Use the font size of 100 points, set tracking to 20 points, and anti aliasing mode to sharp. Change color to white. Using the Move tool, select the text layer and background layer, and then click the Align commands on the top menu to center the text. Add a layer style to the text. Make sure you use the following values and press OK. Let's start with the text effect. First, we are going to add some shadows to separate the text from the background. Go to Layer Style, Drop Shadow and make the following changes. Now we are going to create a gradient overlay which will give a base to the metal effect. Open the Layer Style again and modify the gradient overlay settings to the following values. Click on the gradient bar to make a gradient with these settings. Go to Layer Style, Inner Glow and use the following settings to brighten up the edges. To start creating the 3D look, go to Layer Style, Bevel and Emboss and use the following values. Now we are going to add the previously installed custom contour. Click on the Gloss Contour drop down icon and then select the contour name Custom Contour MK01. Now we are going to emphasize the highlights and shadows to give more realism to the metal effect. Go to Layer Style, Satin and use these settings. We are going to add the second custom contour we installed. Click on the Gloss Contour drop down icon and then select the contour named Custom Contour MK02. Press OK. It's almost done. In this final step, we are going to accentuate the edges and corners, giving the text the final 3D look. Go to Layer Style, Stroke and use these values. Click on the gradient bar and make a gradient with these settings. Great job, you're done! In this tutorial I showed you how to create a metal text effect using only style options. I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial and can use what you've learned for your own projects.